It is now seven o'clock though, and you may start baking. Go, go, go. <laughs> Hi, Amelia. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> How have you been this last week? I'm good, thanks. Obviously, I'm kind of sad that I've been eliminated, but I'm happy that I like even got onto this in the first place. So <laughs> Yeah, like I said, like I've said to you many, many times, you should be so proud because uh, we got a lot of auditions through and you did make it to the final eight. So yeah. Yeah. Uh, and your cakes were amazing. Like like I said, you still did get over a thousand votes, which is incredible. So you should be very, very proud of yourself um about that. Um Thanks. Yeah, what would you have done this week if you were still in? What kind of cookies? Okay, yeah, I've been thinking about this. So um, I was thinking of doing like rainbow cookies, so like dyeing the batter rainbow and then doing like chocolate chips in the middle and drizzling melted chocolate over the top. Very nice. Oh, they do sound so nice. I wish you were still in so we could see you make them. But obviously, if you do ever make those in the future, um, be sure to send them to me and I will show everyone what you get up to. We have got 84 yeah. people watching at the moment. So hello to you 84 people. We've got people saying go Jessica. Um, someone saying Katie, your cupcakes are amazing. Those people just saying hi. If you don't mind saying Amelia, I'm going to ask you a couple questions now. Um, whose were your favourite cakes? Not to offend any of you bakers, they were all amazing. I'm just curious if Amelia did have a favourite. Oh my god, you can't do that to me. <laughs> no, but like if you like liked, I don't know, the colour of Katie's or like, do you know what I mean? If there's any like bits of people yeah. that you liked. Okay, I really like the um, colour of Faye's and I also like the decoration of Maddie's because the mermaids were just so good. Yeah, the mermaid tails did look delicious. Thank you so much. <laughs> That's all right. But yeah, I liked everyone. Thank they were all you. I, wasn't, I wasn't expecting them to all be like that good. The standard was really, really high last week, I won't lie. That's why I thought we'd bring it down, make it a bit more basic this week um, so that you guys don't run out all your skills and then we can raise the bar again next week. Have you got anything that you wish you'd done differently or were you completely happy with your design? I wish I went more like over the top with it because I feel like I could have done something a lot bigger and better, but I wanted to make it simple because it was the first week, but I feel like I needed to make it more big so people would like it. But That's the thing, it's really hard to know what other people are gonna do to then be able to fix yeah. yours off of that um yeah i mean like i said the standard was so 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 high last week you all did amazing yeah. um and like you said your cakes tasted amazing and i guess that's kind of the main thing uh, <laughs> you made more this week didn't you you've made yeah i baked some more um and i sent them over to my dance teacher as well so she could have some oh that's so nice but yeah right let's see if we've got any questions what someone says dance school does Amelia go to? Um, I go to, you probably have not heard of it, but it's called Helen Arbor Performing Arts. It's just a local dance school that I go to. Very nice. Um, I hope you've got any more questions. People are asking me to move closer to the laptop. Unfortunately, I can't move you any closer to the laptop, guys. Um, what else? Will I do a season two? I would love to do a season two, but like I've said, it does depend on how much attention this one gets. Yeah, keep sharing. You're now up to 93 viewers, guys. So, yeah, well done. Uh, people are saying, big up Naomi. Amelia's music cupcakes were really good, says Poppy. Thank you. Yeah, um, yeah people are saying Amelia's cupcakes were awesome. Aww. What, some, but someone asked what, who's my favourite baker. I don't have a favourite baker. Like I've said, the sand is so high. <laughs> Everyone literally shocked me last week. Um, so yeah, I don't, I don't have a favorite. I'm rooting for everyone. Right, let's go through and ask. Let's start off with uh, Maddie. Let's go Maddie. Maddie, what flavor cookies are you doing this week? I'm going for chocolate chip and rainbow drop cookies with these right. ones. I'm just crushing up some rainbow drops now to mix into the cookie dough. Oh, and I'm going to be wow. dying and trying to shake them like rainbows. Oh. That is my plan. 
I absolutely love, love, love rainbow drops. Like I used to buy boxes and boxes. Um, oh yeah. But I've never thought of putting it in a cookie. That's yeah, I get quite a lot because they stay really crisp in the cookie. You kind of think they'd go soggy, but they stay really crisp. They're so good. <laughs> wow, that sounds so cool. Well, good luck with that. I'm intrigued as to how they look. What kind of chocolate are you doing? Milk, white, dark? Going for milk just because I don't really like dark or white chocolate to be honest. So I'm just keeping it basic. Nice. And you see Harry in the back there. Love to see that. Yeah, he's back by <laughs> popular demand. <laughs> Let's go to Kat. Kat, what flavour are you doing this week? So I'm making a classic Nutella stuffed chocolate chip cookie with some dark chocolate on top and some white stripes on half of it. Oh wow, they sound really nice. So kind of like a triple chocolate, but in different form kind of cookie. Yeah. Very yeah. nice. They sound extremely tasty. Um, let's go for Naomi. What kind of cookies are you doing? Sorry, make you come away from your um, workstation there. <laughs> um, I'm doing chocolate and salted caramel flavored oh. cookies. Wow. I'm oh. <laughs> Amazing. I love salted caramel so much. Very nice. How are you doing them? Are you doing them like chunks or are you making it like is the salted caramel? Same. Oh, oh my connection's gone. Hello? Um, how are you doing it like chunky, like salted caramel chunks and or are you making it drizzle? I'm doing it's like the sauce, it's like a sauce sauce that I'm putting like on top in like side with very nice. Well, they sound very lovely. Looking forward to seeing how they turn out. How about you, Emily? Thank you. Um, my cookies are going to be a dedication to the NHS. So I'm going to be doing a rainbow cookie for the rainbow. And inside, I'm going to put in blue chocolate inside of them. Blue chocolate? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> Wow, that sounds really cool. What kind of flavour is it? Has it got a flavour to it or is it just like dyed? I've, I've added some, um, I've added something of extract to it and the candy, the chocolate is quite sweet anyway, so that will, it kind of gives it its own flavour really. Very nice. They do sound lovely and well done for doing it to the NHS as well. That's really cute. <laughs> what about you, Katie? What's yours? They look like they're coming together nicely. One second, yeah, no worries. <laughs> Apologies. <laughs> People are saying, big up Naomi. Yes, Emily. Rooting for Katie. <laughs> um, so I'm making raspberry and white chocolate cookies. Lovely. Oh, I, I do like a bit of fruit and chocolate in a cookie, I won't lie. I tend to yeah. get like um, flapjack cookies. I've had those. If you've ever had those from M&S, they are really really lovely little flapjack cookies oh. i say this <laughs> every week i should get myself whatever you guys are cooking i should get myself a little packet or whatever it is so i can eat it while we go through this because i get so hungry amelia you're yeah. gonna start joining in as well because you don't get any taste yeah. <laughs> it's so annoying amelia what's your favorite <laughs> kind of cooking Oh, I love salted caramel, so I'm actually really excited for Naomi's. <laughs> yeah, salted caramel is amazing. My friends have actually just gone to, um, we're just having a barbecue. They've just gone to the ice cream place that's like half an hour away. And they've gone to get me a salted caramel ice cream. So I'll oh, that one when we're done. Faye, what about yeah. you? Last but not least, sorry you look busy. <laughs> Apologies. What's your cookie? It's all right. Um, I'm doing a bit of a mishmash. They're basically going to be pink, turquoise and purple cookies with um, little Oreo bits, pink and yellow Smarties and dark chocolate chunks in. Oh, wow. They sound cool. <laughs> Is there going to be any batter room? Wow. They <laughs> Thank you. Well, I hope so. And I'm going to do a white chocolate drizzle on top. Wow. See, I love how you guys always go so different with your ideas. It's brilliant. Someone's asking, Amelia, what is your favourite colour and your favourite animal? Okay, my favourite colour is purple. 
And my favourite animal is a panda. Oh, why a panda? Cute though. I don't know. They're just so they're just so cute, and I don't know. I just love them. Fair play. I'll let I'll let you have that. <laughs> People are saying, "Come on, Katie." Said so their favourite chocolate is crunchies. See again, I don't like the honeycomb. Don't like. Oh, them. what I love crunchies. <laughs> See, my <laughs> taste is just not is not along with the basic taste of things at all. Yeah. <laughs> Everyone is asking at what age did people start baking? So Amelia, you can answer that one first and then we're going to go to I don't really know exactly what age, but it's from when I was really little. Like, I used to get them like packet cake mixes and cook with my dad until then I started just doing it on my own. I was like, dad, you can just leave now. <laughs> You're not needed. I'm big now. Yeah. <laughs> yeah cute. How about you, Naomi? What type, at what age did you start baking? Voice up, Lisa. Um, okay, I'm not really too sure. It's like when I was a lot younger, probably like six or seven, I started like enjoying it, if you know what I mean, and like making more and more things as I got older. Oh, nice. What about you, Maddie? At what age did you start? Shout out to Tiffany, by the way. Thank you so much for the gift. Carry on. <laughs> I can't really remember when I wasn't baking. I started like baking sausage rolls and things with my nan when I was really little. But I'd say in the last, like, seven years, I've kind of taken it more seriously and actually been into it a bit more. Yeah, that's completely fair enough. And obviously, as you get older, your skills improve and you can make more interesting things and then in time, like, end up enjoying it more because of that. So, yeah. Fair yeah. Enough. What about you, Katie? Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Raspberries all of my fingers. Um, I've, like, always baked with my gran. Um that's kind of like how I know everything just from a grab. So Aww. it's just been like a, I mean, like when my mum was at work and I had a training day, I'd just go around to my friends and bake it. It's just been like all my life. <laughs> oh, very nice. About you, Kat, at what age do you think you started? Um, well, definitely just been making your average like butterfly cakes ever since I was like tiny, but like only started properly baking in the last year or so, like making big cakes and like piping and stuff. Do you know what I mean? That kind of stuff only in last year so oh, no. quite proud of my my quick come around yeah definitely you seem to have proved in a very short amount of time so congratulations on that anyway <laughs> how about you Jess when did you start baking really uh, I started baking about three years ago very nice what made you start like did you just I don't know what made you kind of it, it was just because um, my cousin who lived with me at the time was at college doing bakery and I was kind of inspired by the stuff she was bringing home. So oh, nice. Very nice. Um, what about you, Faye? Um, I've been baking like, since I was really little, making like birthday cakes and that with my mum. But um, I probably like, started doing it frequently and that probably about a year ago. Oh nice, well, you're quite recent to it as well then. Yeah, I'd say like recent to um, doing like bigger stuff and more serious yeah. stuff. I love your top by the way, really nice. Thank you. <laughs> Very lovely. About you, Emily, when did you start? Um, I started baking about 10 years ago, but it's like the past five I've really taken seriously. And in like the last year I've opened my own baking company. Oh wow. So, yeah. Cool. By the way, guys, you have had 18 minutes, so you're nearly halfway through your time. Would I do this again with the winner as a judge? I would like to do it again, and I would definitely like the winner to go against whoever else we had involved. But having a specific judge, I think that puts a lot of pressure on one person. I mean, Amelia, I, I personally wouldn't like it. I doubt you would either. Yeah, but I would hate that. <laughs> Yeah, no, having all of the pressure on you to decide. And everyone's so good. Like, I don't actually think I could decide because there's parts of yeah. everyone that I wish, like, that I wish would win. Um, so, yeah. yeah. I'd definitely like the winner to be involved again, but not to have a judge. Um, what are Amelia's favourite foods to bake? Someone said. Um, I mean, I prefer baking like sweet things, so like cakes, cupcakes, that kind of stuff, really. Yeah, they're the most interesting, I guess, as well. Thank you so much to Sophia for the TikTok. Will they do a savoury bake? Uh, I'm not sure yet. I, oh, I would like them to. 
but I haven't, I kind of got a rough plan of what they're going to do in the coming weeks. Um, that could change. Um, but yeah, I want you guys to keep giving me ideas to add to my list as well. People are saying, what are your favorite TV shows? Anyone feel free to answer, but obviously be conscious of the sound. I have too many. <laughs> I'm currently watching Modern Family and I'm loving it. So oh, really I honestly <laughs> watch it. love it so, so much. But you, Amelia? Um, I love like all the talent shows, like Britain's Got Talent, X Factor and that kind of stuff. But like a series, I love Friday Night Dinner. Have you ever watched that? Love Friday Night Dinner. It finished though recently. I'm so, so I know. So, so, so yeah. Someone just wrote, is Maddie with Harry for real? Do you want to comment on the situation, Maddie? <laughs> <laughs> Harry's new girlfriend, guys. <laughs> Someone said, has anyone seen <laughs> Life of the American Teacher? I haven't. No, no I haven't. What are your favourite sports? I'm not a sporty person. I don't really like sports, but I did used to do swimming. I kind of like that. I like football, personally. I'm so excited. <laughs> for the Premier League to start up again, if anyone else knows. Yeah, I can see Emily shaking her head. <laughs> Arsenal, <laughs> Wednesday. no, tomorrow. Wow, okay, that's exciting. Um, yeah. I've just seen someone said, you need to watch Nailed It on Netflix, and I have seen that, and it's so good. I love it. Oh, what's it about? It's a baking thing. So basically, there's like bakers that go on, but they're not like good. They're like really bad. And um, they have to make really extravagant things, but obviously they have no idea what they're doing. So it's just, it's quite funny. Wow, that does sound entertaining actually. Yeah. yeah they end up like good at the end or like, are oh, they rubbish? <laughs> no, they are just, they are just rubbish. <laughs> yeah, Fair enough. Yeah. How do you guys think it's going? People have said, are your, are your cookies going well? And yeah. Who's out of the oven? Put your hands up. I've just put mine in the oven. Put yours in. Kat, how's the oven going this week? Are we okay? Much better. We also got a thermometer, so I now know what temperature it actually is at, which is very <laughs> helpful for baking. Lovely. My fellow bakers will know if your oven is not at the right temperature, then you'll end up mess. So. Um, People are saying what they're baking. If you are new to this live, they are baking cookies with a twist this week. So they're baking cookies and putting whatever kind of filling they want. Someone said, have you girls gotten to know each other more over the last couple of weeks? I feel like- Yes, we have actually. Like, I feel like, I feel like we're like little virtual friends now. <laughs> yeah, like naturally through the chats and these conversations on the, um, live streams i don't know i feel like i've, I've definitely yeah. know you girls better um yeah we've got our little chat that we speak in midweek if anyone's got any questions etc the way we communicate um yeah how long do they have in total so they have had 40 they get 40 minutes total they have got just under 10 minutes left okay right. how's the speaking going though do we think we're going to be done on time yeah lovely stuff People are saying, what is it going to be next week? That is kept secret until Friday. Um, yeah, so you guys will find that out on Friday, along with who is out this week. Oh, it feels like the week's gone round so quickly. You guys can start voting. I know. Amelia, you can get involved in the voting this week as well. Um, yeah, I feel like I should just vote for everyone because I feel bad. <laughs> yeah, no, what I'm going to do this week, I'm going to try and change it up a bit. Um, I didn't think of this last week, but I should have is make both options yes and then just add all of the votes together rather than having yeses and noes because I think the poll the percentages of the polls were so confusing because sometimes a video got more views and therefore more votes but it, the percentages were so skewed basically in comparison yeah. to the actual um what's it called like tier list almost yeah, because you could have like 50-50, but you could only have three votes on each, where someone else could have 50-50 and have like 20 votes, so. No, it is, it, that made it really difficult, so I'm going to just try and make it say yes um, for both options. Is someone yeah. on Zoom called Daisy? No, they are not. Uh, what are they making? They are making cookies. Oopsies, Daisy, let's save that. Everyone's saying baked beans. I'm so confused. 
Why? It's like, what did we have last week? It was pigeons. It was pigeons. pigeons. Yeah. <laughs> Gosh, those. It like, was salmon. <laughs> it's like they had. Um, it's like they have their own little chat where they like. They're like, right, this week we're gonna say this. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Oh, so you know they said, is anyone in this chat called Daisy? It's so they could yeah. just put Daisy me rolling. <laughs> oh. <laughs> um, someone said, Amelia, who do you think is going to win? Do you want to say? You don't have to. Oh. <laughs> Everyone's no, I can't, <laughs> I can't say that. <laughs> All right, but, I, mean, uh, I, I do think everyone was really good. So honestly, I actually don't know who I think is going to win. Yeah. Honestly, neither. I think it can go. Because obviously some people are going to be better at making cakes. Some people are going to be better at doing other things. So I guess we're going to yeah. see people's uh, strengths and weaknesses come through majorly. So guys, you have had the full 40 minutes. Um, but like I said, due to the Zoom cutting off, I'm going to give you another five minutes or so. So yeah, you're in your last five minutes. Um, finish up, add any finishing touches. And yeah, this live has gone really quickly this week. Um, yeah, it has. What is your most advanced thing you've ever baked, Amelia? Um, if you saw in my audition, I made like a cake in the shape of a guitar. Yeah. I feel like that's pro probably the best thing I've ever baked, really. Oh, I liked that. That was really cool. Who won last week? So there wasn't a winner last week. It's just going to be an overall winner at the end rather than a weekly winner. It'd be good to bake macaroons. Oh, I haven't had macaroons in so, so long. Love oh, yeah, neither have I. But there are some flavours that I really dislike and then others that are, like, okay. But I feel like it's yeah. like one of the main things that, like, the flavour really matters to how the overall, like, thing tastes, if that makes sense. Yeah. Um, Maddie looked like she wanted to say something then. Yeah. I was gonna say, like, I cannot stand the pistachio macaroons you get, mm. but I love the strawberry ones, so yeah. I think it really matters. Yeah, see, whereas I do like pistachios and I do like strawberries, but sometimes the flavourings of things just ruin it completely. Yeah. Such, such. Yeah, I don't like ones where you can taste the almond too much either. Yeah. Yeah, no, I yeah. agree with that. Same. Guys, you've probably got about 30 seconds left, so yeah. Finish up. What do you got to do? Is everyone ready? Naomi, you look like yours are done completely. Happy with them? Yeah, well, let's have a chat. <laughs> yeah, they went really well, so. Yeah, friends, do they look tasty, smell nice? Yeah. Good. Mm -hmm. Yours were so tasty, <laughs> weren't they? Yeah. Yeah, very nice. I do, I definitely... I would, if I could, they would be the ones I'd probably devour first, I won't lie. <laughs> um, Thank yeah, you. I look forward to seeing your little video and your photo of those for me to put on the Instagram and the TikTok. Maddie, yours done? Yeah, they're all out of the oven now. They're so hot that I just burnt my fingers trying to pick one up. Uh, I baked some extra ones so I can try one as well. Lovely. Have they gone to plan? They look good? Okay, yeah. yeah. Fingers crossed people like them. Good. What about you, Jess? You look done as well. They're a bit funny in shape, but it's because of the Kinder Bueno, so... <laughs> That's all right. <laughs> no worries, I'm sure. I don't... Actually, did I ask you what flavour you were doing? I don't think so. <laughs> oh my gosh, apologies. Sorry, what flavour are yours? Uh, uh, Kinder Bueno and Happy Hippo. Oh, <gasps> gosh, they sound amazing. I haven't had a happy hippo in so long. Wow. Neither have I. Oh, my God. Oh. They've got a boy sauce in the middle as well. Oh, my gosh. Oh, I wish I could try one of them as well. Very, very jealous. They sound amazing. I look forward to seeing them as well. How about you, Faye? Yours all done? <laughs> Go on mute. Yeah, they're all done. All done. The girl has planned. Look good? Uh, kind of. <laughs> okay, do they smell good at least? I don't know. If yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay, well that's that's one thing at least, if you've got that. <laughs> Cat, you're all finished? Yeah, all done, on time this time. Lovely. <laughs> and they look like they've gone to plan as well. Yeah, happy with them? Yeah. yeah. About you, Emily? Yeah, I'm all done now. All done. 
again? Yeah. Yeah. So, yeah. Katie, are you done? You got a couple extra minutes. <laughs> Hurry up. No, I'm joking. That's fine. I like our voice. <laughs> This time isn't strict. If you need a few extra minutes to make it look perfect, that's fine by me. No problems at all. Um, so Sorry, I just wanted to mute. That's all right. Um, I am. I was just doing the extra ones. <laughs> okay, that's fine. Are you happy with yours? Yeah, very happy. Jolly good. Um, so yeah. yeah, well done, everyone. This is this week they got done as well. Um, went really, really quickly this week, but you all look like yeah. again. You completely finished in time well done we haven't had any hiccups other than my little wi-fi and the fact <laughs> zoom stopped but again next week let's see if we can make this even better try and make it run smoothly um but yeah if you could get those videos over to me as soon as possible and the photos and then everyone on the live if you start baking start sharing your favorites around as much as possible if you click on the bottom of the tiktok click share then slide along to other and then just cancel it. That counts as a share still. So go and share your favorites or actually send them into a group chat. Make sure to subscribe to the YouTube channel. Let's see if we can hit a thousand by next week. We are really nearly there. I think we're like 80 away. So if every single person that's live went and subscribed, we would hit the goal. Um, yeah, look out for the next episode. So this full Zoom, if you did miss some, um, up either tomorrow or Thursday. And yeah, get voting for your favourites and I will tell you guys who's next eliminated on Friday. Thank you so much to everyone that watched and also all of you guys as well for baking along. And if you are watching the YouTube video and you have got to the end, thank you so much for watching this as well. Make sure to leave it a like, a comment and share to your friends. Um, yeah, and I will see you guys next week. Bye. Bye. Okay. <laughs>